Hello and welcome to more gaming. I am your host Joe Zamora here, and I am bringing you the 14th episode of Pokemon Conquest. And we are here trying to take over the Ghostly Tower, Spectra. And as you can see, Oichi says Dark type Pokemon should do well against them, but us normal types and fighting types will have no effect on these Pokemon. So we're taking our team here of. Warriors, of course, and we're gonna put this thing down. We're gonna bring the hammer, and also, I would like to say thank you for everyone watching on stream. Hopefully, you're enjoying your time. And if you want to join us on stream and you're watching on YouTube right now, um, I stream Saturday nights. Uh, follow me on Facebook, Zamora Gaming, there as well. And you can watch the streams as they go live, or if you just enjoy watching them on YouTube, leave a like, subscribe, and enjoy the fun. All right, Okuni, come see our warlord, have you? Hey, we have a visitor. My, my, if it isn't Joe. Thanks you so much for coming all the way here. I hate to disappoint you, but we'll be you will be going home empty-handed. No, I'm going to make you leave your home, lady. I'll show you what I'm made of. Alright, so now we get the, the attacking squad out here. And of course, we got all ghosts on that side with poor little Luxray all by his lonesome. So we're going to go ahead. You know what? If, I, if it's detox, I'm okay. Like if it's para... Or if it's para or poison, I'll be fine because of detox ability. Let's keep you away from there. I don't want you getting burned. I don't even want to risk it. All right, we got a full heal. That's good. And we're going to go ahead and come over here. So if anything, it won't attack... Uh, Rhyperior, because we don't want Rhyperior getting burned. He's pretty much our win con. Once this tower is over, I can carry with my travels, right? After all, I have places to go and people to meet. Alright, she's got the big scary Scolipede. What are we going to be able to do against that? Of course, Psycho Cut, but you never know. I mean, if we can't do nothing to it, we can't do nothing to it. Alright, all the Ghostlies are making their way this way. Normally, I like to divide and conquer, but since uh, we have a bunch of Pokemon that cannot even hit them, which is too... Oh, oh man, I was hoping for poison. Oh, okay, it burned uh, It burned us there. It's not good, but it's not horrible. And this is why I do not like this castle, because the statues moving around is really inconvenient. But let's go ahead and get Eevee going this way. Let's get Rhyperior away from these flames. Gallade sitting back here. Jigglypuff over there. <coughs> and it's okay if you're in the way of the fire because, I mean, you're already burned. We'll get away to get him not burned anymore. I hope. Alright, Drifloom is coming over. I think it's going to attack Rhyperior. Yep. No flinch. Alright, cool. Mistrevious comes over. But we're not playing Red Rover. <clears throat> Alright, Miss Magius is there. Scolipede's moving over. Dusclop is parried and sitting there. And of course, Lampet's over there with his flame burst ability. We gotta watch out for that. Oh, perfect. Poison on them. That's what that's exactly what I want right there. 
And sorry if you can hear my breathing. Uh, I can't breathe through my nose very well, so. I'm, I'm a mouth breather today, guys. Alright, I'm going to sit here. I'm going to get some damage off. Not a lot, but damage nonetheless. Hopefully we get some damage off here. Don't miss. Beautiful. I'm going to sit here since I have the full heal. I'm also going to move there. And I'm going to use Lightning Rod. It's not going to hit. It's going to boost my attack, though. Which is fine. Attack boost is great. I'll take it. Alright, of course that thing wants to flinch me. But we can't attack this turn anyway. So we're, we're kind of in an okay situation there. Shadow Sneak into Darumaka. Ooh, does hefty damage. Oh, beautiful. And attacks his own partner. But we do lose Darumaka. Alright, Gallade and Shinx get hit. Or Luxio, I should say. No flinch. Alright, beautiful. Ooh, and that thing's getting damaged. So that's beautiful for us. Oh, confusion. No, that's, that's the last thing I wanted. Ah, they're playing kind of strategic too because they're moving into the range of Rhyperior. And it's hard to get uh, out of Rhyperior's range. And Luxray is going to be there trying to discharge and I'm not going to be able to. So I might be falling into the trap. All right, here we go. <coughs> Let's go ahead and get some damage off on this Scolipede. Because we need it. Ooh, and that's some hefty damage, too. 39. And we get poisoned, but I'm okay with that. Uh, we can't move at all. Okay. <clears throat> uh, Lightning Rug takes the hit. So, I mean, at least I'm boosting my attack. I'm not getting no damage off, but I will get big damage off here shortly. Alright, let's see. Bustle. Okay, so... I can't do much to boost my attack here, but at least I can get some pretty big hits off on these things. Alright, Jigglypuff is out here. Alright, her turn. Let's see what she does. Alright, pair. Good for us. Alright, okay, so they get the flinch again, which is very unlucky for us. Oh, and they're going to double hit him. Okay. That's trash. But at least you can't shadow ball him. Alright, got damage off on us, but there's still damage on them. Shadow ball has to be two range. It's going to hit Rhyperior, which is fine. Ooh, not fine. Critical hit. Don't knock him out. No! I was about to get a big hit off with Luxio there. It's fine. We're managing we're managing this battle though. The important thing is Um as long as we can get Scolipede out of the way. And if we can rock wrecker this turn to the Lampet and knock that thing out, we're in a real good spot. 
Oof. Okay, don't miss, buddy. Beautiful. Lampin is out of the way. One less Pokemon to deal with. All right, here's the issue. I don't think Gallade could take two more hits, so I might have to use my healing healing power here. But I really don't want to. <coughs> but I'm going to have to cuz if I if he does get knocked out, I won't be able to use enough turns with Rhyperior to knock everything out. Yeah, I can't hit it, so it sucks. And the game knows it, too. It has me in a really bad spot where I can't move at all. Alright, Drifloon goes off. Does 23 damage. We can't get flinched twice in a row, though. So that's a good thing. Alright, he actually moves himself out of place so he can't hit us at all. Which is good for us. Alright, here we go. Yeah, we wouldn't. I don't think we would have lived that... Uh, those two turns and scolipede's gonna hit us but i'm fine with that mistrevious is almost down and out okay the statues are taking forever as usual Okay, I can't rock record twice, but I can hit the shit out of Scolipede. All right, that's 20 more damage. <sighs> I hate this. Um, let's see. All right, let's get some damage off. Ooh, critical hit. That's going to help a lot. All right, that's not good. He lowered our accuracy on Rock Wrecker. Oh, man, this is not good. A lot of damage off on Jigglypuff, which is normal. Oof, and Gallade's not going to live to tell the tale after this turn. Eh, I flinched anyway. Whatever. We might lose this one and have to try again. Hey, Cherry. Welcome to the stream. Yeah, I love this game. I've been playing it on my own free time. And now I'm playing it here. Uh, I think uh, I'm on the second story on my own thing. I'm also trying to 100% it there as well. So, I mean, I've been having fun with it. So, thank you for joining. All right, so Scolipede is there. We're going to try and knock it out with our normal types since that's the only thing they can hit, which is annoying. But this is Pokemon, and that's how type advantages work. All right, so we're going to get another 22 damage here. We'll figure out how much damage we can actually get with, uh, with this thing. All right, Jiggly, just keep hitting. Alright, here we go. Alright, I wish I could go back far enough to knock the other thing out. Oh, but... Eh, no, they got him pretty much cornered. I'm just going to go ahead and knock out the Mistrevious. Oh, the accuracy down hurts us. Right away. Yeah, guys, I don't think we're going to have enough turns to knock everything out. The only good thing is Mistrevious goes down, uh, not Mistrevious, Miss Magius goes down next turn to Poison. It's going to get some more damage off on Rhyperior, but there's nothing we can do about that. Uh, Scolipede is pretty pinned down. It's going to get some damage off here, but it should go down to our normal types next turn, depending on how, how many hits we get with Jigglypuff. 
And I think uh, the misses are going to be what dictates what happens in this game. All right, Miss Magius is gone. Sadly, even though I missed last turn, everything's out of range for Rhyperior to hit. So uh, if that statue can move that's right behind Rhyperior, that'd be great. Of course not. Oh, Miss, are you kidding me? Yeah, I think Misses. Oh. Misses are gonna cost us this. Whatever. Oh well. Somehow she gets HP, which is annoying. Drifloon sits there. We're probably gonna hit that one next. Just don't flinch, please. Okay, whew. I was about to get really fucking annoyed. Again, I did have issues like this in my own game. So, I, I knew this was coming. But, jeez, you really wish it wouldn't. Especially having to rely on Rock Wrecker, which is already... Horrible accuracy. Alright, so let's go ahead and get some damage off. Critical hit makes up for the miss. Alright, let's get four turns. Oh, and you miss. Alright, let's go ahead and kill this Drifloon, please. Beautiful. Critical hit there. I, I, I mean, that doesn't really make up for a miss because we still waste a turn. But, um, hopefully we can knock out that Dust Snore here. Be, be parried. Alright, no flinch, no flinch. I mean, I use Rock Wrecker, so I, mean, I wasn't going to have a turn anyway. Oh, it all comes down to this. It's going to come down to the final turn. <coughs> okay, let's get three hits with max roll. Why do you miss so much, you bitch? All right, whatever. Please, no flinching. Oh, that doesn't help us at all. We're going to lose. We're going to lose. Leave me alone. Okay, good. No flinch. Thank God. Can we kill this thing? Like, it keeps getting health out of nowhere. Yeah, we don't win this, sadly. <sighs> All right, let's keep on trucking. Let's keep on trucking. Let's try to get it. Let's try to get it. All right, can I get a crit? No. Can you not miss for the fucking fourth time in a row? Of course not. Stupid bitch. 280. Another interference. Why not? I mean, it's not like we're going to make the, the hit anyway, right? Or at least get in range. No flinch. Of course. Oh, this game is for sure. Especially since they stuck me with two fucking normal types to begin the game. But I love to get Glaceon to make the game ending easier. I might have to evolve. I might have to evolve uh, Eevee to make this battle a bit easier. The only question is into what? I'm looking it up. Let's see.
Let's see what Jolteon gets. No, oh, what the hell? Conquest Pokemon. Jolteon. What move do you get? You get Thunderbolt. I'm I'm switching it and I'm I'm gonna evolve it into Jolteon. Decision made. But at least we'll get some damage off here. Oh, great. I get to move again. So I can hit nothing. And I'm going to stand here so this freaking thing can't be moved. We still have somewhat of a chance, but with all my accuracy drops, I highly doubt I'm going to win it. Yeah, what, never mind. They, she just keeps getting in the way. <sighs> Jesus. Well, YouTube's not going to like this. <laughs> well, let's go ahead and finish off this battle. If these fucking statues can stop moving so much. Alright. Come here, boy. Let's go ahead and at least collect some shit while we can. Oh. Eevee goes down. All right, we didn't flinch. We have somewhat of a chance. We have to hit the next two rock wreckers. Oh boy, this is not ending. No, actually no, there's only two turns left. I lose regardless if I kill or not. So I guess that's GG to the Spectre damn thing. Not a ghost of a chance for us in this one. But we're gonna take time to evolve our Pokemon to Jolteon and it's gonna be a whole hell of a lot easier battle why couldn't that happen like 30 minutes ago what the fuck Jigglypuff that's annoying she could have put them to sleep a long time ago you're a waste of space oh well in these turns let it run interference i'm surprised we hit that move actually three three accuracy drops or like five actually oh and everything's got to move so much does it really matter of course, the game wants to hoe us and block us, even if we didn't have a chance. But if we did, we'd be fucked. Just end turn. Oh, they still have a turn? That's annoying. It's okay. Oh, he misses. That's hilarious. It's okay. We're going to evolve Jolteon in between episodes if you're watching on YouTube. And we're going to go ahead and the next episode is going to be a whole lot better. So for those watching on YouTube, I'm going to end your video here. Those watching on Facebook, keep on trucking. We're going for a while. Thank you guys for watching and I will see you guys next time. Don't forget to like and subscribe.